Hi, this is Ethan Purston and Margarita, my Cuban parrot, with Kids First, and today we're reviewing Vivo. Vivo is a heartwarming movie that has happy moments, funny moments, and tragedy. I like the storyline, the graphics, and the catchy songs written by Lin Manuel Miranda. Vivo is a computer animated film about a kinkachu monkey who knows how to play instruments and performs at one of Habana's plazas in Cuba with his master Andreas Hernandez, an old musician. Andreas has a female singing partner once named Marta Sanduval, who he was in love with, but she moved to Miami, Florida to become a star. Marta is performing one last time because she is retiring, so she invites Andreas to perform with her for the last time as a duo. Marta doesn't know that Andreas is in love with her and that Andreas wrote her a song when she left Cuba. Tragedy happens and is upon Vivo to deliver the news and the song to Marta. This movie has a beautiful computer animated scene. The backgrounds simulate the city of Habana in Cuba, Key West, and the Florida Everglades. The scenes are very colorful and bright. The songs are very catchy and appealing, and besides being the main character's voice, Lin Manuel Miranda also wrote 11 songs for this film. He offered Cuban legend Gloria Estevan a part in this movie, and she had the opportunity to create her own character, which is a mix of Salia Cruz, another Cuban legend, and Miss Estefan's mother, who she described as a diva. This film has a stellar cast, including Zoe Sedana from Guardians of the Galaxy as Rosa, Michael Rooker from The Walking Dead as the Snake Lunador, and Leslie David Baker from The Office. The story reminds us to always express your love to the person you love because it might become too late for it to do it. Also, open the heart to the person you love and let them know your feelings before it's too late. My favorite part is when Vivo delivers the letter through Marta. It provided closer for his beloved partner, Andreas. I give Vivo 5 out of 5 stars and recommend it ages 5 to 18 plus adults. This film is also a great asset for the Cuban community, especially now during Cuba's troubling times. Vivo is in theaters now and begins streaming on Netflix on August 6, 2021. Uh, this is Ethan Person signing off. See you later. Keep the